All right, dudes and dudettes, welcome to Valhelsia 5. That is right, everyone, Valhelsia 5. We are finally playing it. I've been a big fan of the Valhelsia series for a while now since Valhelsia 2. But guys, we have some fun stuff we're getting into today. Valhelsia uh, is on 1.19.2, uh, potentially going to be going to 1.19.3, hopefully here soon. But we do have quite a few mods here that I'm excited to use. For one, we're going to be getting into mechanism today, obviously, from the title. Uh, another thing, too, I want to get into is blue skies i don't know if i'll be able to find it right away yes blue skies we're gonna be getting into this as well something i've never got into so you guys should be looking forward to that but uh let's get this far departed Okay, so over here, I have a couple of things in my chesticle. So, um, we have a little bit of osmium. Now, I haven't done, like, any mining at all. I mean, we have, like, just a couple of diamonds, like, a, a couple tools, an enchanting table. So, nothing crazy at all. I did get a, a little bit of iron uh, from an iron vein. But, yeah, as you can see, we don't have a lot going for us. Uh, but we do have a little bit of osmium, which is going to be really handy for today. Oh, and we're going to need some copper as well. So, we're going to need to make a heat generator right off the bat and that's gonna require some iron too and we do have some charcoal smelting up maybe yeah we don't need anything else okay uh let's make some planks here Oop, not that okay perfect and there's some crows in the background which are kind of neat cool so we now have a heat generator so what we're gonna do is temporarily because i don't want to burn my house to the ground i could do something Yes, let us do this something. Yes. Good. Now fire take us off. So we don't have to really worry about the lava burning down our house. And I normally do that. I just forgot to do that with this pack just because uh, if someone accidentally starts a fire, I don't want it burning down an entire forest. I don't know because I wasn't the one who did that at all or anything um actually i'm gonna place this the other way around so the green side for this heat generator is going to be where the power comes from and the really neat thing da, 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 um we're gonna need that one so we don't well we don't really need that but i want to place the lava bucket on top oh um i think that's new I didn't know you could place it in there. What if I do this? Nice, okay, so this should generate, yeah, this is generating some power. We can also help it along, but oh my gosh, that really burned through that, holy shnikes. Okay, what if I do this? Oh boy, that might be bad. Yes, that was bad. Okay, so this is making a little bit of power, it's good. It is kind of, Passive power again. It's not a lot of power by any means, but oh jeez, that was weird. I got to get it back. Anyway, it's not going to generate a lot of power for us, but it'll generate a decent amount. So now that we have the heat generator, um, you know, it might not be the worst idea in the world to make two of them. Now that I think about it, um, yeah, I think we're going to make two. So we're going to place uh, this guy here. We'll mine this block and this block, and then we'll place the lava bucket here. Hmm, I almost wonder. Oh. Can things not burn? Is that what's going on? Hmm. So if we do this. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure things aren't allowed to burn in this pack, which is kind of funny. The birds are crazy. Oh my goodness, is there any way to turn them off? Please, birds, shut up. You're so loud. Is it friendly? Nope. Environment? Oh, I feel like I could barely even hear myself think. Good, now we don't have the birds tweeting so loud that we can hear all of their words. Okay, so now we need to make some of that. Uh, and we can do this, but we will need to utilize some cobble of the deep. There we go, so we have five of those. Uh, I'd ideally like to make two, perfect. Whoa, okay. So we got two of these guys, and this is just going to make things go by so much quicker because we don't have to wait for one machine to be done in order for it to start working. 
But yes, oh boy, that is going to be crazy. So it's going to be important that we start making energy upgrades as quick as we can. Actually, can we put any energy upgrades in this guy? Um, muffling upgrade, that's it. Hmm. I mean, it's producing 3.31 FE per tick. That's pretty low. Freedom Heights. Uh, 281 degrees Fahrenheit. Wait, this is molten lava, dudes. What the heck? That should be way more. Lava is very, very warm. <laughs> okay, so that's good to know. My 3D printer prints things hotter than Minecraft lava, which is kind of crazy. Almost double the, the temperature. That's nuts. That's nucking futs. Anyway, so we have those. We're going to utilize some charcoal here. I do have a couple smelted up. Um, I was going to smelt up some more. I guess we could do that here. We need quite a bit because we're going to be turning these into steel. The real steel bill spiel. So um, this guy here, we're just going to we'll put 20 in there. And that should be good for 10 of these. Yeah, so I believe it'll use 20. Is that right? Oh, only 10. Okay, perfect. So that's actually going to be a little bit more than we actually wanted. Um, but yeah, this is, yeah, as you can tell, it's not keeping up very good. Hmm. Okay, well, we only need, we only need two ingots for now. So let's just make those and we can kind of combine these guys together uh, because the universal cable requires steel. And the easiest way to make steel is by uh, smelting up some steel uh, nope, not not that. Some steel. Uh, come on, please help me. Some steel dust from mechanism, and that's just enriched iron thrown in right here. We have steel dust, and then we just throw this into the furnace, and it is all good to go. So we'll get those uh, ready, and then we could make. Let's see mechanism. Mechanism. Cool, cool, cool. Um. Gonna need a couple of these guys. We need six gold. We've got it. Perfect. All right, so we can make two windmills. That's gonna be lit. Okay, so here's the steel. Perfect. Let's. I'm hold. I'm holding iron. Hello, iron. Thanks for tagging along. Okay. So we'll do now hopefully we'll grab that hopefully we'll grab this and then we're going to combine these together and then we'll also do this that way it's just they're going to be combined together so say if we're only using one of these it'll be able to use both of those temporarily once we get into the windmills it's not going to be a lot okay so that's got the coal we're going to throw in some redstone we have quite a bit of redstone so we don't really need to worry about it but then again that's utilizing both of these guys to produce power and it's using 20 i mean that's way more than we're producing but i mean six is better than three right <laughs> uh, okay so now we have a total of a six of those okay ooh, we could actually make three of the windmills hmm. okay so we're just going to try to make this here and so that's going to require osmium we've got the schmosmium those okay so we need one of those two three four five so we're gonna need a total of five of those for one windmill and then after that okay so we've got four let's do five there we go so we have the alloy that started it all infused alloy pretty neat and the thing about the Valhelsia packs is they typically don't have a quest book so it's really up to you how you go about the pack which is I, I mean honestly I, I really enjoy that um, yes yeah, so we have the two there and then all we need is the osmium one and we have a windmill cool and this is gonna take our power game up to the next level so osmium ingot beautiful and it's just cool because we can have all of our redstone in here all of our carbon in here and then like in, in the future we're gonna need a diamond and then a enriched obsidian one and we'll be set. So here we go. We got a windmill. Wind power. 
on the first episode. I love to see it. My mouse is being crazy. All right, wind generator. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so we can just place this guy here. Yep, and there we go. So this guy is producing 29.82 FE per tick. Wait, no. Yeah, 29.82 FE per tick. That's what it's producing. Cool. And the higher we put this up, the more it will produce. So what that means, we can go ahead and make a couple more. And we'll make we'll make one more of these guys. We can put it right here, and then we'll be generating 40 FE per tick. And so that just means we'll be generating more power. Okay, so we now have all the items to go ahead and make a second one, I believe. Yep, we just need these guys. Perfect. All right, and boom, there we go. Second windmill. We are good to go. Now, I really like using these windmills from Mechanism uh, because they're really simple to set up, really simple to create. And the higher you put them up, the more power they make. This one's getting 29.8. Okay, so it's the same, but yeah, like so now we're producing quite a significant amount of power. Uh, we can afford to go ahead, maybe put ten in here. Actually, we're gonna put eight because we did two before. So now we'll let those guys go, and then we'll create uh, some more here, and we'll continue on. Yeah, let's see what we what we can do now. That was pretty quick. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and create a purification chamber and a an enrichment chamber. So we're going to start off with this guy. That's going to require four steel ingots, some glass, and then some osmium. Um, and how are we looking on osmium? Oof, we're looking pretty low. That's something I got to be on the lookout for when I'm mining. I thought I had more. Did we already use it all? Keepers. Okay, so yeah, we don't have a lot of osmium. And that is okay. We got more of these guys. Uh, enriched iron we'll put some more back because we need those to go perfect oh i didn't show you guys but i have a cow area over here that we'll eventually slice and dice and tell them they're not nice oh please don't explode thank goodness Alrighty. so yeah um this is where the base is at world spawn is about 500 blocks uh, south of us, but it's pretty cool. Uh, we have uh, cow sense over here, laser beam over here, knucklehead mics over here, uh, Didache over here. Oh, I said that right. And then we also have a woodland mansion right here. So I did a little bit exploring. We have a mesa. We got some desert. This is why I was over here to grab some sand for desert stuff. Uh, oh, we got a couple other bases here. Jess XTs and then Aussie cucumbers. Oh, we found another one. Very cool. Uh, bubbles. Nice. So it's just cool being able to see that we're all like relatively close um, this season or this mod pack because there have been a couple of times where we've been spread out by I think over 10,000 blocks. So it's pretty cool that we're pretty close, but not too close where we're lagging everyone out. But yeah, this is where I decided to build my base. I think it would be pretty cool here. Maybe put a factory or something along here. I don't think I'm going to go with a village vibe because I never seem to finish those. Um, yeah, so we're just going to do kind of a factory ish looking place on the water maybe a little futuristic maybe not who knows and uh yeah so steel dust perfect but um yes we oh we can put that there perfect all righty so enrichment chamber oh we need two of those i think we're out of osmium enrichment chamber will help us with a lot let's take our purification chamber will help us out with a lot um wait yeah i need an enrichment chamber not the purification chamber yet and i need the smelter hmm where did you go smelter smelting basic smelting factory we just want to energize smelter and then i would like to make a sawmill where's the sawmill here we go precision sawmill yeah we're gonna make these three items so Let's get the osmium going. Uh, eventually, it'd be cool to have this within our base for well, For now, we'll, we'll make do. Uh, two osmium in there, and we are out of osmium after that, which is a bummer. Do I need that to make a sawmill? <sighs> Darn. Precision sawmill, enrichment chamber. Those are almost exact. Oh, they're, they're pretty close to being identical. But yeah, we need to make the enrichment chamber because this thing will help us so much. Um. 
yeah, it turns three ore into four, so we do get 25% more. It'll also allow us to turn coal, charcoal, that into enriched carbon, which will get more use in the in uh, energy the thing that we made over there the energetic or infuse or whatever it is but yeah this is why we're making it because this will really really help us out sulfur to gunpowder that's pretty cool but how do you get sulfur in this pack get it from gunpowder you wouldn't figure huh okay but yeah we're gonna <laughs> you can just do this whole loop where you're just losing resources ah oh, that's so much fun i recommend it but yeah we'll see cool beans so we should richmond chamber we're missing the iron the redstone and the glass i should have some glass here yes perfect now we need the steel casing ah it requires an osmium that is a bummer we are out of osmium we use our two osmium for this. Haha, mm. -ha, I found some osmium, so we'll mine this. And uh, yeah, we desperately need to enchant our tools. We have three more. Is there any more around, please? Oh, yes, we got one more. L Ooh, two more. Oh, it's a pocket. Oh, this is 10. I feel dumb. No more osmium, just tin. But we do need tin for mechanism anyway, so I guess I'll mine it. Good. All right, with that one more osmium ingot, we can go ahead and make the steel casing now, and then we can make the enrichment chamber. Beautiful. Freak yeah, this is gonna be awesome. So now we can put this guy here, and this will take redstone and, oops turn it into enriched redstone and then it will yield way more so right now if we take redstone so we have 200 one redstone is worth 10 and an enriched redstone is worth oh geez 80 <laughs> so it's eight times more efficient to use the uh, enriched items so yeah we're gonna keep using we're gonna keep doing that um but yes very good very good, very good. Okay, so now we have the enrichment chamber. Let's see about energized smelter. Ah, okay. Hmm, that's gonna require three more osmium and I don't have that. I guess I just need to go mining for a bit and get some osmium. Uh, I'll be right back. Well, 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 we're just out cave and we got some diamonds. We also got a bunch of these pots here and then we're up to eight raw, raw osmium and then five raw iron. Oh, geez, there's a skeleton, I heard him. Dangerous. That guy, that was weird. Oh boy, we're not doing well. Uh, we're gonna die! No! We're still alive! Oh my gosh, I almost jumped into the lava. Um, I have no food. Well, cockroach, can I eat you? Please! Please! Let me, ah, undead miner. Oh, well. <laughs> cool. So back here, um, yeah, we, we died. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, we can go grab these diamonds now, which is amazing. Very good. We only got three. No fortune. So it's, it's painful, but, you know, we need the diamonds to get things and mechanism rolling. So we got to do it. But, yep, getting some gold. Other thing. Well, that bat just died. But I did see quite a bit of osmium around here, so pretty... What is that? Is that a geode? Oh my goodness, I might die. I might die. <gasps> yes, not from the geode, but from excitement or the lava. The lava almost got me. Cool. That one looks fully grown. Yes, it was. It was fully grown. Great. Cool. So let's break... Oh, I thought that was a bug. Torches. Seeds ash ooh ooh seeds cobwebs okay if we don't pick those up it's gonna be mad well this seems like a fun cave let's see over here is where the osmium was 
Bros. And there might be bad. Oh, more diamonds up there. I just saw them. I just saw them. Oh, wait. I'm going to put that there. Come here, diamonds. I love you. <gasps> more. You guys are my good luck charm. <gasps> more. What? I, these are so much more than I thought I would get in my lifetime. Just kidding. Hello? I hear somebody. The Hashling Slasher is over there. Hmm, yes. What is this? Nickel. Hmm. Where's all the Osbeam I saw? We got, I get distracted. Like, these are cool. Ooh, iron. Seeds. What's in you over here, friend? Ash. Okay, uh, yeah, that's some Osbeam is good we desperately need that is this osmium yes this is hello nope no one there okay we need we need all the osmium i don't know why i placed that torch there it's completely useless but i figure we do a little bit of a caving this episode so just kind of bring you guys along with me not because i don't have anything to do or nothing there's lots of stuff i could be doing for a video that's not definitely not waiting for more materials. Yeah, totally not. Anyway, um, that looks cool. It's kind of those things. Let us deal with the menace, Dennis, over here. Hello? Wasn't there a skeleton over here with an enchanted bow or something? Or enchanted armor? Maybe he ran away. He didn't want to be Dennis the Menace anymore, and that's okay. Wait. Look how... Wow, that is so difficult to see lead. That's ridiculous. I kind of like it, though, because you got to be looking for it. you got to be ready. I like it a lot. Good, 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 good. What's in you? Cobweb. I said cobweb. I thought there was more somewhere. Was I mistaken? We got redstone. Always good to grab. Hmm. You zinc. We have a lot of zinc. Zinc is good for create, which is a big part of this so we might need to grab some. We are out of sprintage. Food is definitely a th commodity to have right now. Farewell. You, Nickel. Well, we're up to 11. Um, I want to get one more because then we can get another 25% from that. What are you? Oh, that was just a glitch. I thought that was Skylight. Zinc. Frick. Zinc? I already have a zinc. That was, that was lame. I'm sorry. Um, we need one osmium. I guarantee you there's one osmium in here somewhere. Don't do that. Dumb bat. Well, he can't be dumb anymore because he's dead. Yo, diamonds right there looking at us. Or is that. What is that? Okay, those are diamonds. That's crazy. How did I miss those? How does one even miss diamonds like that just right in the way? Found Skeletor. He's gonna drop right on my head, isn't he? Scare the crap out of me. Here it comes. No Skeletor? Alright, Skeletor. You do your own thing. I almost caused a cave in. Oh, found him. Found the Skeletor. And we found our Osmium. It's 
Skeletor is blocking it. Ah! Skeletor, no! Let's get our Osmium and go! All we need is one more. <laughs> there was just one. Come on. Okay, I'll tell. We'll, we'll go back. I teleport. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, we are back. And I almost threw these into the furnace, and I'm really glad I caught it. Um, but yeah, we're gonna throw them into the enrichment chamber. How much shall we be using? 20 FE. Perfect. These guys, well, as long as we're using one machine, we'll be totally fine. Like, they'll, we'll never see them go down. Uh, we could actually use two machines, and we'll never see it go down. But once we get to three, then we'll be pushing it. But this is good. Look at that. We're going to get a total of four more ingots out of it. So it just means more osmium for us, more things that we can build. Fantastic. So what are the, the benefits? What are the end game parts of mechanism? Well, we do have these really cool bins that we can store a lot of items in. They look really good. Um, we have the mecha suit, which is a really overpowered armor. Uh, we'll get more into that once we have it. Uh, we have the robot, which is amazing. This guy follows you around like a chest. He's a crafting table. He does a lot of cool things. This plus is just fun. Uh, we have the atomic disassembler, which is uh, a really good mining uh, tool. Uh, we have a jetpack you can get. Obviously, you fly around. Uh, free runners. I believe these negate fall damage from the jetpack, but they use power. Uh, we'll definitely want to do the armored versions of those eventually. Um, but yeah, like there's a lot of really cool things. There's also a, a quarry or what is it? It's not, it's not a quarry. It is the digital miner. This is kind of a quarry. It goes out and mines certain things for you. Um, but yeah, the mecha suit is definitely locked behind a lot of things. So we need the, the polo polonium, polonium pellets. Which require polonium and seed oil. Seed oil is fine, or water is fine. But this stuff, nuclear waste, we need to get a fission reactor going. Like it is a process to get the armor, but once you get it, it is fantastic. And that will be our goal probably by, I would say, maybe episode 10 or 15 to have that completed and on. Um, we'll do a couple other projects in there, including doing stuff in Blue Skies, uh, which I'm really excited about. I've never like really dove into that mod at all, so I think it'll be a lot of fun to uh, test it out. Uh, but let's go ahead and create these quick things here real fast. And I think I just dumped all our stuff here. I shouldn't have. Um, we're going to need some glass. We're going to need some of this and some of that. And then we can make... Uh, oh... Oh, we'd still need to smelt up the osmium dust. I forgot about it. That is all right, my lads. We don't have anything else to smelt. Um, Maybe we can smelt some stairs. That might do it. Have some stairs. <laughs> yeah, but we're also going to make the the, the uh, energized smelter. We'll get rid of this whole problem for us where we don't have... And like we'll just we'll utilize the windmill power to smell things. So yeah, that's what we're that's what we're wanting. So we have the osmium here. Let's go ahead and throw in the osmium into this far guy over here. Actually, we're gonna do that just in case. I have I have more in the storage, but I don't. Well, nope. We need this too. It's a little bit of wasted power. That's okay. We just need the two of these, and we're off to the races, my friends. Cool. All right. So, with the oh, door closed in my own face. All right. So, this guy is all that we need. We just need the iron. No, we need the steel. Um. Yes, there's the steel. Perfect. Okay. So, steel boy... Booyah, we have the Energized Smelter. That is so good. Oh, man, because now we can just utilize power to smelt things and we don't have to worry. Cool. So, yeah, we just put things in there. They get smelted. We can put upgrades, make it even faster than normal smelting. So there we go. That guy's good to go. And let's make the sawmill. The reason why we want the sawmill is because we can make uh, dust, uh, the sawdust which can be turned into a cardboard box and this can move spawners. So that is what we are going to be making now real quick. Um, so yeah, we'll throw, I should have just thrown these four in there. I feel silly. 
I fell silly. I didn't feel silly. I fell silly. That's kind of silly in of itself. Okay. Um, where did? There's my osmium. We need one more smelted or uh, processed up over here. Oh yeah. Cool. And then, what does the enriched iron? What can you do with that? Oh, reactor glass for mechanism generators. That's cool. And then yeah, steel. I think. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Good, so we have these completed. And it's just cool because now we can just utilize our charcoal and stuff like that for either the carbon or like torches. Like we don't have to worry about using it to smelt things, which is going to save a lot of charcoal. And like we're going to have to chop down a bunch of trees over here, so we're going to probably just turn those into charcoal or use them for something else. And then now check it out. Energize smelter. This only uses 20 FE per tick. If we start doing the upgrades, um, the energy upgrades, this will take even less, and then we can run all of these at the same time, no problem. Yes. So very cool, and they're a bit loud. So we can always uh, throw in an upgrade, which is the muffling upgrade, and it will reduce the noise and make it quieter. So now that those are in there, yes. Two steel ingots, and then the third ingot is now in not by maybe inventory perfect the third one is good to go come on fourth one i am encouraging you to do good stuff <laughs> i'm sorry i'm i'm just trying to entertain you guys until the end of the video anywho here we go so we should have everything to make this except the glass perfect Alrighty, and we need iron. We need red. Oh, we have these. Perfect. That is everything to make the sawmill. All right. Yep. So the sawmill, the energized smelter, the infusion. Um, yeah, metallurgic infusers. They are all good to go and working amazing. This thing's already got power in it oh man ladies and gentlemen that is going to be the first episode of val helzy of five if you guys did enjoy it please make sure to hit that like button and as always don't forget to subscribe but guys as a late welcome to 2023 happy new year yeah i took the month of july off or pff, july i took the month of january off and we are back at it so thank you all for watching we're gonna have a lot more of these coming out my new work schedule is gonna really allow me to record a lot of these and still have a really healthy work-life balance so i'm excited about that but anyways ladies and gentlemen i'll see you all in the next episode take care peace out Bye bye